My name is Scott Peterkin and I'm a partner in the property division at Burnus Paul. Built to rent is a hot topic at the moment. I think it's part of the solution to the undersupply of housing in Scotland and there is no doubt there is a severe lack of supply in Scotland. If you look at the demographic of 19 to 36 year olds, if you look at that 20 years ago, almost 50% of them would own their own homes. If you look at it now, it's less than 20%. And I think I, I, the house builders will need to and want to adapt to that particular market because as the number of people that can afford to buy houses shrinks, so they will have to look at how they do things. And traditionally, house builders have operated on a turnover model, so you buy the land, you build the house and you sell it, and you try not to hold on to it for as, uh, for as long as possible. I think that might change and there will be house builders I'm sure that will look at more of an ownership model and you know take on the role of landlord and manager of some of the estates that they're building. The build to rent that we're tending to see and this is replicated uh, south of the border as well is that a lot of build to rent projects are in prime locations. I mean, they're perceived as possibly risky and so you de-risk it by building somewhere where people most definitely want to live. The more secondary locations around the city are not going to be attractive at this stage to build to rent uh, investors, but there's certainly a demand for high quality, affordable mid-market rent that can be properties that can be constructed by the private sector.